Grace. 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 What is grace? It can be defined as a merited consideration, a state of divine satisfaction. Grace is like going to the top of a building without stairs, elevator, or ladder, or flying to the skies to commune with the stars without a feather. Grace is the wind that blows off every disgrace and is the reason for hope in every season. Grace is the stability in the midst of the storm, that extraordinary flair to what has been numb. Grace is an emancipation from a land of condemnation, a justification from obscure oppression. Grace is like an ocean so deep you can't fathom its base, or like a woman so beautiful you can't but stare at her face. Grace relieves the pain that has laid on the sands of time. Wiping up the confusion and sadness. Grace, even when it seems as though you have become broken again, it becomes your legal binding, assuring you of your assurance in him. Grace is the cleaner of our every flop, becomes a suspender that even gravity can't pull you from the top. Grace is the incinerator of hardened hearts, melting them like wax, and cease past denominations for giving souls from Africa. Asia, and even the Palestinian nations. Grace is the makeup of our deficiencies and lack. The very foundation that allows us to blend into him so we do not need concealers because he has torn down those veils and his word has become our revealer. Grace is the brick on which our faith is built on, the rock on which we stand, the very reasons we can boldly call ourselves his sons. Grace is the addition to your subtraction, making your sin equal to nothing in his equation. Grace, oppose your head at an elevated angle. So even when your feet tangent, it keeps you constantly at right angle with him. Grace is the reason I know that my name is in the book of life. And so when I stand on that line on the last day, the words of the master will be, thou faithful servant, well done. Grace makes beauty of his gospel. And so I constantly paint them on the hearts of men as the artistic apostle that he has made me. Grace is coming into Christ, believing in your heart and confessing with your mouth that Jesus Christ is Lord and Savior over your life. That, brothers and sisters, is grace.